Hi, this is Mr. Estabrooks with another video on uh, drawing, uh, multi-view drawing, and drawing dimensioning. So today what we're going to do is uh, we're going to um, sketch a multi-view of this part. Um, it's a puzzle cube part, typical to what we do in the puzzle cube project. Yours will be different, but uh, we'll start with this and hopefully that'll get you uh, started on your own. So. Um, the first thing that's important to do is choose the best front view. We've already gone over the rules of that in class, and um, we're going to decide that this will be the best front view because it describes the shape and follows all the other rules as best as we can. So my front view is going to look like this. Remember, I want to see the top view up here, so orthographic projection means that the top view is going to look like this when we look at it from the top, and the right side view from over here is going to look like this. So let's get started. I'm going to start, just do this quickly with the front view. Of course you're doing this without the benefit of having your parts in front of you, so you're just going to have to visualize it. I want to make sure I don't lose that edge there. Okay, so there's my front view. Now to project the top view, I sketch very lightly construction lines going up to the top from each of the edges on the front view. And I do the same thing to project the right side view. Okay. Now I understand that this part is coming forward, so that's going to be my forward part. Sometimes it's useful to kind of sketch the glass box. I know this is two cubes deep, so my glass box is going to be three, six, something like this. I can fill in those edges. Don't forget to fill in the edges of your object, nice dark object lines. And the right side view, again, I know it's the glass box is two cubes deep. And this one's going to look like this from the right side. So there's my completed uh, orthographic projection. And if I want to complete the isometric view, remember the isometric view should have the front pointing to the front view. So I would do an isometric view on isometric paper looking something like this and then uh, paste that in there. So there we have front Front, top, right side, orthographic pro projection. Thanks for watching.